Hi there, I'm Nathan, one of the marine scientists here at RS Aqua, and today I'm going to be answering some of the frequently asked questions you have about Subsea Imaging's latest underwater camera system, the Rayfin Mark II. So there are actually two different variants in the Rayfin range. There's the benthic, which is this one here, which is rated to 6,000 meters, and it's ideal for deep water marine research applications installations in ROVs and AUVs. There's also a shallower variant called the Rafin Coastal, which is rated to 500 meters. And this is good for shallow water, shorter term applications such as fish trawl monitoring. Both can also be used in observatory and drop tow applications. So the Rafin Coastal weighs 800 grams in water and 2.4 kilograms in air. And this bad boy here, the Rayfin Benthic, which is made from titanium, is a bit heavier, weighs 1.6 kilograms in water and 3.2 in air, so... chunky. <laughs> Both Rayfin models can transmit 1080p HD video over coax or ethernet, the latter of which is the more popular option, and also 4K Ultra HD over fibre optic cable. So the coastal variant can also transmit live HD video over Subsea Imaging's Boost Power Comms, which is a low-cost twisted pair subsea cable option. The Rafin has two auxiliary ports on the back of the housing here. This means the camera can handle up to two Aquaria LED modules on a Y-splice cable and one laser module on a single cable. Yes, up to a maximum of 3 to 4 hertz continuous rate. This means the camera can take up to 3 to 4 stills per second. And that's it. If you've got any more questions about the Rayfin or any of Subsea Imaging systems, please don't hesitate to get in contact with us or visit our website. Catch you on the next one.